Everybody knows that before making a photo, you have to focus. Here, everything is clear. We need to focus on the eyes. Here, everything is also clear. But here, where should we focus? Maybe on this stone, or on that one, or on everything. Yes, that would be nice, but it's impossible. Usually, photographers try to maximize the depth of field when making a landscape photo, extending from the foreground to the background. But in order to achieve this, we need to focus on the right place with the right parameters. Today, we will tell you about the method that will help you to focus during the landscape shooting. Sometimes we have the following discussions with our students. Look, it is really easy. There are special apps. With their help, you calculate the parameters, set them, and at the end you get a picture with a maximum depth of field. Is it clear? Yes, but maybe it is possible to do it easier without any calculations. It was an interesting question, and we came up with the original method of doing the focus without calculation. Let's assume you want to make a photo of the landscape in a way that the foreground object and the background object are sharp. The photo camera is on the tripod, ICO is on the minimum, focus mode manual, aperture for example is 11. Turn on the live view mode, magnify the part of the frame where the most distant object is, as much as possible. Set up the lens at the minimum focusing distance, the picture becomes some sharp. Push the button Preview Depth of Field. This button closes the aperture, imitating the sharpness of the future photo. Slowly focus the lens until the distant object becomes sharp. It is important to stop immediately and not to rotate the focus ring any farther. And that's it! Now the depth of field for the aperture 11 is at its maximum. If it is not enough, just slightly reduce the aperture and repeat the procedure. But remember that very small aperture decreases quality of the picture, so don't reduce the aperture if it's not necessary. 